So I want to show you how easy it is to get started with using Google Classroom. So here on the left hand side I have a teacher account. I'm going to type in classroom.google.com. So you want to go to Google Classroom, classroom.google.com. And it's really important that you choose that you are a teacher. So I'm going to click teacher. And since this is my first class, I click on the plus icon up at the top and I choose create class. And it's creating the class. And then what I want to do is I just want to list, it gives me a little tutorial, I just want to list what I want students to do. So I'm going to click on the plus icon in the bottom right hand corner and I click create assignment. And so I always number all of my assignments, number 001, warm up is on the board. And I can say uh, do the warm-up on the board on a piece of paper and click assign. So that's how easy it is for me to post assignments to Google Classroom. And then I want to click here on the students tab and, it, and so I want to click on the little drop down arrow here. I like to reset my code until it's not ugly. I don't like O's or L's. Uh, some, something a little more decent. It has a zero in it. I don't like that. Uh, this has an I. I don't like that one either. Oh geez. Sometimes it will take me 20 minutes to get one I like. Um, this almost looks like the word bus. So I'll go ahead and go with that one maybe. So as a student I just give this code, this class code, to the students. And so over here on the right hand side you'll notice that I have a student account and the students are going to do plus join class and the code is 336BU6. They just type it in and they are in the class and the student is then able to see the assignment. This is what they're supposed to do. If you'd like you can have them click on the open button. The student clicks on the open button and the student can mark it as done. And so that they have completed that task even though it was not digital.